So it look like I'm actually live now. I want to say welcome to another live stream. My name is Oral McKenzie and this channel I will teach you how to grow your YouTube channel and help you solve your everyday tech problems. You know I like sharing my knowledge with you because I strongly believe that knowledge is power and I want to empower you all. So if it's your first time here, I love for you to subscribe to our channel. Now in this live stream, I'm actually taking you through the steps of how to actually live stream on YouTube properly. Not only will I be taking you through the step, I'll be looking at the benefits of you live streaming on your channel. So we'll be digging deep into live stream tonight and one of my subscribers actually requested this live stream. I think his name is um, We Are Kings of Music. So I hope he, he is actually here and he's in the chat. But for you guys in the chat, I want you to do two things for me. I want you to give this stream a thumbs up and I want you to let me know if the audio is actually good. And if you can, you can actually share this out to other persons that are watching. And I can see in the chat that we have Crafty Crafter and his some of his friends there. Also, Paper Object is actually there. And we have the regular persons. But if you're is if you're first time on the stream, we love to have you and we welcome you all. Um, just to add that um Crafty Crafter, you, you actually missed out on some lovely stream that we had since week. But the good thing about YouTube, or one of the best things about YouTube is that. When we do live stream, they're actually re-uploaded to YouTube. So you have all the time to go and re-watch those upload. So let me just take a quick look in the chat, see what you guys are saying about audio and everything. And then I'm just going to get started. So remember that I'll, I'm a guy who always check in the chat. So any question you have, you can put them in the chat. So I'll actually check in the chat while I'm presenting. So let's go to the chat and see what's going on. So in the chat, um, Crafty Crafty is saying, I don't see lag. It's probably just me. I ha I gave paper object a sh shout out. Yeah, sorry, that took my tablet away. Um, guys, is the audio in the chat? Um, is the audio good? Um, paper object is saying, oh, paper object is confirming that audio is okay, and everything seems to be fine. So now that everything is fine, um, we're actually going to get started so i see you know, we have um a new person in the chat um who is that person that that let me see if i can pronounce it that seems like um khaled mache mache or mache um if that's how your name is pronounced let me know we're, we're glad to have you on our channel and we welcome you so let actually let i'm just going to actually go straight into this whole live stream thing so let's just get started any question you guys have put it in the chat and remember to give this stream a thumbs up so let me actually get started with this stuff. So um, let me just get this thing up for you guys. And actually, I'm going to show you what's going on. So guys, if you're not yet live stream on your YouTube channel, you definitely need to start live stream. It's live stream at least once per week or once every two weeks. Just try and start live stream and try feel it out because it will definitely help your channel to grow. And as you, if you can, if you're if you're actually seeing everything on my screen, let me know. Or if I need to move myself out the way, you can, guys can let me know. But live stream helps your channel grow. YouTube views viewers watch four times longer on a live stream when com compared to normal videos that you actually upload. Also, live stream will actually increase will increase in new subscription by forty percent. Forty percent increase in new subscription you'll get if you actually live stream on your YouTube channel. Another amazing thing about live stream is that 70% increase in channel watch time. So you'll get 70% increase in channel watch time when compared to normal upload. So if you guys are seeing everything on the screen, you guys can let me know in the chat. And so I'm going to have to hop in the chat and then I'm going to move on to some other, thing as other things that relate to live stream. So what, what are you guys actually seeing in the chat? Let me see. Um, well, well, sub then. Um, um, Mashidi said, I'm new. I'm a new member here. Okay. Um, where are you watching from? What's your name? Khaled Mashi. Where actually are you watching from? And what is your YouTube channel about? And you are actually in the right place because we have very awesome content for you. Also, Crafty Crafty said, someone asked me where they, where they shout out and got this day 
Um, what, 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 let me try to read that slow. Someone asked me where they are. Shout out was. And get this. They, they are new to my channel. Okay, I'm, I think I almost understand what you're saying. So, Khaled is saying, I'm from Algeria. So, we're glad to have you, man. Any questions you have, put them in the chat. And we're more than happy to answer your question. Any questions you have, any questions as it relates to YouTube. We're here to answer your question and any, any question you have as it relates to the live stream, feel free to put the questions in the chat and we're more than happy to answer your questions. So I'm going to actually move on with the content. So let me just up, up over and keep going. So um, the next thing we're going to look at is um, on YouTube, there are two main ways in which you can actually go live. So you can, you can use stream now as well as you can actually use events. So we, we're actually going to look at the differences between them so we're going to look at stream now first so they said stream now is ideal is ideal for those looking to stream one the on the flight so what they mean that like you're not a person that want to plan out event you just want to go on and stream so you want to stream on the flight the next thing that is good about stream now is that no need to schedule the event ahead of time you just go ahead and start streaming it automatically start it start your encoder and YouTube will automatically launch the event for you. It um, consolidating and simplify interface. And it said most likely to be used by gamers, video broadcasters, and breaking news event episode and flexible production schedule. So for stream now, you just set it up one time and all you have to do is to go to and you don't have to even go back to YouTube. You just go to your encoder and click the button and everything will be fine. And you're good to go now you also have events so events is ideal for per, for partners with a strict content schedule and those who have multiple sim, simultaneous stream planned so you actually this like is a planned stream is not a snap one and it's pre-schedule the event and specify a start time so users know when to tune in um it's it's manually started you won't go live until you are ready the interface offer um option with settings nest, nested within their own unique um, tabs and it's most likely to use by people who have concert festival high profile premiums um red carpet events major advertisers and stuff like that so that's actually the difference between the, both of them but um i'm gonna head to the chat now and then i'm gonna actually go go to my youtube and show you exactly what's the difference between them so let me see what you guys are seeing in chat and in the chat, um, I can see that we have Brands Haas joining in the chat. We also have Karaji in the chat. Um, who else we have joining recently? So Paper Object is asking me. He's saying someone asked me why didn't they got a shout on on Craft the Crafty channels, and I guess what, aren't they aren't even subbed? Okay, um, you got you on Craft the Crafter is talking about something. So Craft the Crafter seems to say um. Gotta wake up early for hockey. And Karaj is saying, hi everyone. How everyone is well? Karaj, yes, we're actually doing well. We're actually looking at how you, tell, you can live stream on your channel and what are the benefits. So we have, I've gone through two slides already, two very important slides. But I think you will catch up with everything that is going on. And people object saying, I swear every time, less so weird. Uh, I'm not sure what you're saying dear people object. But Brands has is in the house and she's saying, I swear, um, let me see if I can read what Paper Object was trying to write. He's just, he seems to retype it. Brands has is saying, hi friends. Hi Brands has, how are you doing? We're glad to have you. Paper Object is saying, I swear every time Crafty Crafter leaves, Kari J comes <laughs> so weird, like what, what on earth? So when one, when as exactly when one is leaving, the other one is always joining. Um, Pretty much might be it's a tradition or they, they planned it or something like that. And Brands are saying, can't stay long tonight. No problem with that. We're just actually running through the topic. I think I'll be going for about 45 minutes or all. Um, Paper Object is saying, they, they made it better. Um, Brands are saying, having a hard time with, with a thumbnail for an interview show. I just did. I don't like the current thumbnail. Um, what are what programs are you using to make it thumbnail? Let me know in the chat. So I'm gonna head over and try to provide some more information as it relates to the live stream. 
but I'll have it back in the chat very shortly. So the next thing about live stream is that um, live stream is actually it's great. Um, so YouTube is actually great for live stream. And let me show you some of the, the way why I said that it's actually great great for live stream. It's home for all of your YouTube videos, live and video and demand together on one platform. It's easy to go live. You can stream from a mobile and you can stream from a computer. You can use an encoder. You have the, um, actually three different ways to go live on YouTube. Fan engagement. Viewers can chat and sh and actual interact in real time. And reach and discovery. How users find you um, actually is actually easy. So persons can actually find your live stream very easy because if they're watching one of your videos while you're live, YouTube will actually show them that you're actually live. And you can monetize it. Earn money with um, pre and mid roll ads and super chat. And I'll be getting into super chat and all of that um, pretty shortly. So that's why YouTube is actually great for live stream. So we have gone through all of that. So we have gone through um, that. We have gone through. So, Kari J, maybe this is a slide that you miss that YouTube is um, YouTube viewers watch four times longer live stream compared to normal video. And it will it will it will also increase your subscription by forty percent and seventy percent um watch time. It will increase your watch time on your channel by seventy percent. So those are actually some awesome things about YouTube. So I'm gonna actually bring up my browser and show you the difference between both ways in which you can go live. And then I'm actually going to go into some more stuff like how you actually manage the chat, the engagement, explain about super chat and other stuff so we're actually just getting really started um let me just read a few comments in the chat and then i will go on going on um car j is saying canva is great i use it paper object is saying yeah me too paper object said and i use snap tool brands has carry i did an interview you watch it i don't like the thumbnail i'm redoing it now Karji is saying, what kind of problem you having with it? I did just purchase Tube Body Pro. Well, that's a good tool. And Karji is saying, cool at Branzard. That's awesome. Yes, that's cool. So you guys can keep the chat going. And also remember to give this video a thumbs up. To give this live stream a thumbs up, I mean. So let me actually show you the actually two different ways. To go live on youtube so if you notice right here you have um let me show you on this one so let me go to live stream right here so i'm waiting for that to load and while it's loading i'm just gonna hop back in the chat so karija is saying i watch the interview brand okay yeah i like how you you um the persons are actually supporting each other that's awesome i like it um paper object is saying at karija i figure out zero your name channel is orange i'm not sure what you're talking about people Jim. so if you're watching this live stream please say your name in the chat so we can give you a shout out and stuff like that and we want to keep the chat engaging so i'm actually waiting for this um browser to come up so i can show you something um so first this is the stream now and i'm going to show you how you can set it up um so it's still loading i'm going to give it a few more seconds while it's loading i'm going to hop back in the chat and karji um you like the thumbnail i made for the hangout we had last night what are your thoughts on it brands has did you see the thumbnail that i actually make for the little um collab we had last night do you like the thumbnail let me know down in the chat um, so I'm still waiting on this to load. But um, paper object, I couldn't get to put your face on it because I was trying so hard, so hard to get a clear, clear shot of your face, and I couldn't just, I couldn't just, I just couldn't get a clear shot of your face. So I said, I know what, I'm gonna leave it out because you definitely don't want your face to be shown. So I was trying to get a, a clear shot from the video. Of your face to put on it and i just couldn't get a hold of it um 
I'm still waiting for this to finish load. So as soon as it finish load, I'll be rolling in. Um, paper object is saying I like it. Guess who is in the house? Just school is in the house. How are you doing, man? We're actually teaching about live stream tonight, and we're actually going over some slides already. Slides, slides already. But I'm actually going to show them now the different types of streaming and how you can actually zero in on it. How to actually dive deep in it. So this is stream now, and this is event. So if you come here and click stream now, when you click stream now, this is what you will get. So you notice, um. I'm actually live streaming now, so I can't really show you much. But right here, you have like where you can change your thumbnail. So you, you can actually set a thumbnail for the live stream. So if I click change thumbnail, the thumbnail will, will be changed. I can select a new thumbnail. But the basic information is just like you upload in a normal video. Um, you will put in the title of the video right here. You can actually change the title. You will actually add the title right here again. And what you want to do down here is to schedule when you want the stream to be up and you actually select public down here and if you have some option right here that said um stream options so i'm going to click on stream options and show you guys what it, it's all about so if i click on stream options you will notice that it said um enable dvr and what dvr means is digital um video record so for this, it will viewers will be able to see back up to four hours while you're streaming. So what this actually means is that while you're streaming, somebody can actually bring back the stream and see what you said in previously. And you can make an archiving unlisted when completed. So if you don't want it to be uploaded to add or to be archived, you can actually select that. So notice you have some other option right here. You have normal latency. Now latency means if you guys don't know. It's actually how quick YouTube um, actually analyze what you're saying, what is coming out of your camera and your audio and send it out back to the, to the entire world. So that's what latency means. So normal latency is best for highest quality viewer playback and higher resolution. While low latency means best near real-time interaction with minimal playback buffer and Ultra low latency means best real time interaction does not support DVR plus option are 1440p and 4k resolution. So, for normal latency, persons are going to take about 30 seconds to hear something when you say it. So, when you say something, it will take about 30 seconds to get to the person that are watching on your, on your YouTube watch page. While low latency take about 15 seconds there about. But ultra low latency is the latest that's been released about two weeks ago or something like that. And with ultra low latency, it's like a three second to four second. So when I say something now, it will get to you guys on the watch page on YouTube in about three seconds. So it's more like a real time interaction. So when you guys are setting up your live stream, be sure to select um, ultra low latency um, when you come to stream option. And of course, you can monetize your live stream so you just click monetization and you just ensure that you're monetized you're monetizing your youtube video so ads can show on it and you can earn some money and also with the monetization there is super chat now with super chat it's very awesome um i think super chat is available in 21 countries for purchasing and viewers from 41 countries can actually um um, buy a super chat while they're live streaming, but of course your channel have to get to 1,000 subscriber before you can you are in you are eligible for super chat. And what basically super chat is is allow you to earn money while they're live streaming. So one of your subscriber can purchase a chat. They can select from one dollar to five hundred dollar. And what will happen is that when they select it and actually purchase that super chat, it will show up on the top until they stay there. For a, sh um, a, a little time, so that they, the person that is actually hosting the stream, can see your chat and note and notify the chat, and everybody else will see your chat. It will be highlighted and it will be remain on top for a while. But it's also an opportunity for the host, the person that own the channel that is streaming, to earn some extra money. So um, super chat is very awesome, and it's a good feature to have. 
So brands, as, as soon as you get to 1,000 um, subscribers, and I've seen that you're live streaming, you'll be able to use Super Chat. The Super Chat is actually great, and it's available when you're actually live streaming. So you see Super Chat grow your channel, um, live streaming grow your channel in so many ways. It allow you to earn extra money, and it also enable you to get more watch time, more subscriber, more everything. So you, you guys need to really be pr um, practicing to go live on your YouTube channel. Of course, you can come and visit us in Jamaica. When you make some money with Super Chat, or you make some extra money, you can definitely come and visit us. So that is it for the two ways in which you can actually go live on YouTube and how you can use um, the Super Chat and all that. Now I'm going to show you how to manage the chat. How do you actually manage the chat? So to manage the chat, what you want to do is to actually ensure that you're seeing the chat. So if you're using OBS, there's a way in which you can put the chat in OBS, but it tends to block out the screen if you're just using one monitor. So I wouldn't suggest, I wouldn't suggest that you actually do it that way. I suggest that you do it um, how I do it, in that you have the chat like this in the watch page. And you're, you're seeing everybody what they're seeing in the watch page just like how i'm seeing everybody right here and if somebody is misbehaving you can actually click on their name right here three look at that and you can actually go to their channel you can report them you can remove them you can block them you can put them on timeout you, you can and you can also add them as a moderator but um there are some other ways in which you can actually manage the chat and i'm going to show you that just now how to manage the chat properly because you have to manage the chat especially if your channel has like a lot of persons live what if you have a hundred persons watching you live the chat will be going very fast and you need to manage the chat properly so i'm going to show you some other ways in which you can actually manage the chat and then we're going to get back to some ways um in the we're going to go to the advanced setting of setting up the advanced settings for the live stream so um let me see that's nice you can link you can kick people out um yeah you can do all of that but i'm going to show you how to set it up the real way so what you want to do is to come right here where you have community and you want to click on the community settings and i'm waiting for that to load then i'm going to show you some some awesome stuff um i think i need to reload that page it said snaps so i'm reloading the community page and then i'm going to show you some other stuff that you need to actually set up um pay brands i said paper did you find the emoji um hard times um brands as you saying carry um are you on a PC? I doubt she's on a PC. Um, Karaj is saying, I just got a call. I changed the thumbnail. Not super happy with it. Um, no brands ads on my phone now. Question. Live show, can you have guests on on it with you? Um, Brads, your, your question is said, live show, can you have guests on with you? Yes, you can have guests. Remember, you guys were my, all my guests last night on the live show. Remember that? You you didn't remember? You don't remember that? That you, you can have guests on it? You mean, let me clear up a question and let me know exactly what you want to ask. All right, so if you notice right here on YouTube, when you go to the community section, you have the comment section, you have messages. Hope, hope you guys are seeing what I'm showing you. If my face is in the way, you guys let, need to let me know. But just to be on the safe side, what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually put my face over the other side. So hope you guys are seeing everything now. So you guys can let me know if you're seeing everything 
All right, so let me show you guys what I'm showing you now. Well, let me see what you're saying in the chat. Yeah, I, it was fun for me too. I like it. We're gonna we're gonna do it every Tuesday night. So to uh, this is another way to manage your chat. What you want to do is to go to the community settings, and then what you want to do is to go right where they have community settings and what you want to do is to click on the community settings and I'm just waiting for that to finish load up so I'm just gonna give it some time to load up and if you notice right here you have um where it said moderators so if it's it said these users can remove comments which appear in in your held or review page and they can actually they and can also moderate your live stream chat messages. So if you notice, I have, I have three persons added in here as moderators. So how to add a person as moderator, all you do, you go to their channel, and brands as since you are you are always in here, I'm going to add you as a moderator. So to add a person as a moderator, what you will do, um, you will go to their channel page. So. Let me show you guys how to do that. And brother says, question, you have to have two screens open in order to see what audience is saying if if they are not in Hangout with host slash guest host. I want all on my show too. No, you don't have to have two, two monitor. I have one monitor right now. But um. What I was trying to say to you, if you want to put the chat in OBS, if you're using OBS to, to, to host your live stream, then you, do, you would need two monitors because you don't want the chat to be blocking what you're showing persons on the screen. So in my case, I'm using one monitor, so I, 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 I monitor the chat from the watch page. So I'm going to show you guys how to add a moderator. So I'm going to add you, um, I'm going to add you brands as, as a moderator. So I'm going to show them how to do that. So to add a person as a moderator, what you just do, you just simply type in their name. So I'm typing in um, Brands has So you have two A in your name. And I think this is an E. Brand. Brands has so what I do, I press enter right there, waiting for your channel to load. So I'm going to add you as a moderator. So to add a person as a moderator, you simply go to their channel. So you go to their channel, and what you want to do is to copy the channel URL. So I'm on your channel now. So this right up here is a channel URL. So all I have to do to add it as a moderator, I can just copy the URL from right here, copy it, and actually go right here, and I just click right in here, and what I'm gonna do is to paste it in here. So I just press Control V and paste it, and your picture will come up, and I just click Enter. I know you're added as, as a moderator in my chat, so you can do all those stuff. But remember also that I can add you as a moderator from the chat itself. So there's two ways to do it. But I'm, I'm just showing you how you can do it if you before you go live. Because what if you want to add the person as a moderator before you go live, then this is how you will do it. Now you can approve users. To approve users, use flag menu on the comment page. So this is where you can approve users. This is where you can hide users. So all these persons have been spamming my channel. And they're not allowed to appear on my live stream or my channel any at all. So these are persons that I have hide hide them, so they can't access my channel any at all. So another another feature you can actually set up to manage your chat is you can put some words in it that whenever these words are they type this word in the chat, they will block it. So if they type sub for sub, check out my channel. If you use this or URL or any web address or anything like that it's chat is going to just subtract it so you won't be able to put to, to access it some persons like to put links in your channel to promote their channel in your own chat so you can just block those things automatically and this will help you to manage the chat so you just click this stick right here that said 
New comment with hashtag and URLs will be held for review. Live chat messages with URL will be blocked. Your moderator and other approved users can still post link. So you can post link and the moderators can post link, but other persons can't post any link in there. They will, they will be blocked. So this is how you actually set up your thing so you can manage the chat. So message in chat, um, message in your chat, you can hold potential inappropriate message for review. So once you put anything in appropriate in there, it, it will automatically hold it. It won't appear in the chat. So you just this is how you set it up so you keep the chat clean. So this is how you can manage the chat. You can use these features to manage the chat as well as you can use other persons to manage the chat to help you manage the chat as your channel grow. So what you want to do when you do all of that is to click save. So when you click click now that I click save, um in the chat, brands are you're supposed to have a blue thing against your name that gonna highlight highlight you that you're a moderator in the chat. And that should be something awesome. So you can use other persons to help you to manage the chat. So let me see what's going on in the chat now. Because I'm going back to the chat now. So I'm just waiting for the chat to load up now because I'm not sure what you guys are saying now. So in the chat, brands are just saying, um, this look like a long time chat. So I'm still waiting for the, the, the chat to load up to see what you guys are saying just now. I think I've read past these chat already. These chat seem to be old chat. And I'm just waiting for the chat to finish load up. I think I've passed this already. So Justin Bennett is currently in the house. He said, I'm at work. Um, You're on the job. Oh, you're doing the work. No problem, bro. You can still listen. We're here hanging out. Brands is saying, happy Friday to you all. Kari J is saying, I got a phone call. Nice to see you, Kari. Um, so Brands has, can you type something in the chat now? And let me see if you're actually a moderator. I'm watching the chat guys. Can you, can you type something in the chat to let me see if you're actually a moderator in the chat now and if you're actually added, added as a moderator? So Justin Bennett, the topic we're actually doing is live streaming and how it benefits your channel and all of that. So um Brand, Justin Justin Brands are just saying, Justin, I think we are going over how to live stream on YouTube. Yes, that's what we're actually looking at. Um Brands has, Carry, refresh the page again. Read it for the fourth time. Ha ha. I'm here. I think I am. Um, it has a tool, but beside my name. Yes. So that's how you add somebody as a moderator. So you're actually a moderator on the channel now. So you can use it wisely. So that's a cool feature. So that's how you manage the chat. And actually demonstrate and show you guys live how to manage the chat. So the next great thing about um live streaming is that it's engaging so you can actually engage with the with the specific creator in real time settings ask them any questions and it's like a live conversation so that is what i like about chat it's very awesome very awesome um car j is saying maybe your title could be brands house tips for landscaping by silbe caleb um caleb um what else mel choir you could put where the green banana banana is tips for landscaping just a suggestion okay that's a good that sounds as of a reasonable good suggestion to me kaiji so um guys another thing that i want to tell you about um live stream is that the internet speed that you're using should be at least Five upload and ten download if you're going to have um, problems with your live stream. So that's another thing that you need to look at. Another thing about a live stream that you guys also need to look at is that live stream is one of the awesome way for you to reach and discover new people. Because 
YouTube actually put um, a priority on the live stream. You guys, remember to give this video a thumbs up. Remember to give this live stream a thumbs up. So that's basically what I want to present to you guys about live stream. So is there anything, anything that you guys want to know about live stream? Any questions you have for me? Anything you want to learn? Let me know in the chat what you guys want to know about live stream. Any questions you have based on what I've presented and the stuff that I've gone through. So I'll be, I'll be watching the chat. Yeah, yeah, live stream is definitely fun. Is 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 a one of the ways to grow your channel really fast. So you guys let me know in the chat any questions you have about live stream. Anything that you want to ask me. Because you guys see that I've been streaming like every day. Every day I've been live streaming. So I have a very good experience about live stream. I should have about 40 at live stream now. So you guys can let me know in the chat. Any questions, anything that you want to ask about live stream? So Brands as I saying, I know I will have a bunch of questions when I actually do it. I might live stream one day. Harry you need to start live streaming. You definitely need to. Um, Brands as I saying, if I start live streaming more, maybe more followers will come. Yes, remember we just went over that. It's not a maybe. Let me show you. See, um, look at this. 40% increase in new subscription. It's on 70% increase in channel watch time. More subscribers will definitely come when you live stream. Um, Brandon is saying, I will live stream all the time on Facebook, but you don't get paid for, for that. Um, you need, if you, if your goals if your goal is to grow your YouTube channel, then you need to live stream on YouTube. All right, you need to live stream as you on YouTube when you can to grow your audience here. Is there is there any question? Anything you guys wanted to ask me about live stream? Anything else? I'm watching the chat. So brands are yes, 40% increase your subscription by 40%. As at least that's what YouTube is saying. You can definitely watch the replay on brands as. Okay. So if you guys don't have any more questions, who are the person that are watching? Crafty Crafter gone. Justin Bennett is at work and paper object gone. So it's just um you it's just three persons watching just now. So I'm um, actually here. Um um Karaji said she don't have any more questions. Um Branzas, is there any other questions you have as it relates to the live stream? If you guys don't have any more questions, I'm just going to end the live stream and I'll see you guys tomorrow with another new topic. So I'm watching the chat to see if you guys have any more further questions. Okay, so thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys tomorrow. So high five, fist bump, see you guys tomorrow with another great stream. I'm actually out. You too, KJ, you can have a blessed night. Have a blessed night to you all, everyone, and thanks for watching.